Hey everybody, how's it going? It's your man here, Cater85, and I am back for another installment of my Let's Play Pokemon Omicron. And today, guys, we're going to be taking on the Superior Gym. Um, but before that, uh, I need to apologize for not getting um, any videos up yesterday. Uh, and that is because I had Lucario over. We were working on that game that we always talk about a lot. Um... And I think it's going to pay off sometime soon. I think we're really close. We just need um, one Sprider. That's all we need. So, again, if you, if one of you guys are a Sprider, make sure you um, contact me on Twitter or use the email that I use for business inquiries because that's what I'm using for that game. So, um... Before uh, we go and take on the gym today, you guys, we do need to take a look at our party. And um, I did a little bit of grinding. Uh, where you guys aren't going to see it, though, because um, it's a let's play. This is a let's play. It's not um, <clears throat> like, uh, you know, it's not... Um, a Nuzlocke where we have to prove that we grinded. Honestly, even if we cheated, I don't know how you can cheat in these games. Like, honestly. Uh, but, uh, let's go ahead and take a party review. Um, let me actually put Mrs. Hoot up front. Because Cutie Moan, obviously, as you can see, is a little bit lower leveled. But, that's okay. As, uh, we have Mrs. Hoot. Our Hoot Hoot level 13, yeah. Uh, it's got a naughty nature, which ups attack and lowers special offense, which is not the best. It's got keen eye, uh, which is really nice. Um, and it's got perfect speed stat. Are you kidding me? It's got really good in everything except special defense, which honestly, I'm just fine with that. So, we got tackle, uproar, peck, and hypnosis. And that's really good. We got no ribbons, because who the crap gives a crap about rib ribbons? <laughs> yeah. But next we have Julio, our horsey, uh, level 13 as well with the brave nature, which is, again, not the best nature that I could have. Uh, but it's got sniper, um, which... I apologize, guys. I'm so tired, but uh, it's got sniper, which... um makes the critical hits uh, to times 2.25 instead of times 1.5 for any critical hits um, and it's got uh, actually I, I never checked its IVs it's got no defense um, but other than that it actually looks like it's got really good uh, EVs uh, I wish we had a little bit more in special attack though but we have pound smoke screen bubble and water gun and providing moral support in the back, we have Cubone, our jolly, no, Cutie Bone, our jolly Cubone. I know the 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 um the name is just too good. We got uh, Rockhead, which uh, is good for them double edges and head smashes. Um, and let's take a look at our IVs. We have trash IVs, except we have perfect defense, which I mean. Can't uh, I can't lie? It's pretty good. We have Growl, Tail Whip, Bone Club, and I think we learned Headbutt in the Grinding Montage, but we might have uh, gotten it in the last episode. So we're gonna be, as I said, taking on the gym. Um, so let's go ahead. I think we actually never went inside here, so I'm gonna go ahead and talk to you. Um, legendary Pokemon. Well, I think that this is um, supposed to happen later in the story. So, let's go ahead and uh, enter the gym. As uh, I wonder if the gym leader is awake yet. Because I am. It's, but we cannot see ourselves. Is this like a glitch or something? Can we talk? Oh, we can talk to the gym leader. Alright. 
Um, I don't want to do the same voice for the guy in Fire Red because honestly, he is the exact same sprite. So I'll do. <clears throat> I'm sorry, I have like a cold or something, and I have the yawning to say. <laughs> I have the Yanni Syndrome. Uh, alright. But, <sighs> hey there, champ, the making this is your first gym, isn't it? Well, listen up. At the far end of the gym is Stefan. Your goal is to make it across the gym and defeat him in a battle. But hold on a minute. It won't be that easy. You're invisible. Alright. So, that, that might have been nice to know right away when you talk to us. But, uh, we're invisible, uh, Devon is a firm believer that you need to find yourself before you can fight others. Devon won't fight you until you've found the four flowers and found yourself again. Best of luck. Um, well, well, we have a flower here. Three to go. I'm gonna actually take these guys on. Jeez. I don't know why, but... I must have swallowed some crap overnight, but, uh... Let's go ahead and talk to this guy. I've been practicing. I can see those who can't see themselves. Really? Good for you. Nobody gives a crap. <laughs> ha! Get wrecked. Black Belt Samson, who has a Makuhita level 8. Not bad at all. And I meant to use the peck. So, you're going to go ahead and go for the focus energy. We're actually going to go for peck this time. Oh, and we learned uproar in the grinding montage. I'm like, thank God, because honestly... It's a great move, as you can obviously tell from the Wismers, but, uh... uh we're gonna stay in here, and we're gonna go ahead and peck again, and see how much this does to a level 9 Meditite. Gets it down to the red, not bad, and it's gonna go ahead and try to set up with a Meditate, but... Since we did more than half damage, we're gonna take it out here, with a super effective peck. Just imagine... A hoot hoot pecking. A meditate. Meditating. Yeah! <laughs> I don't know. I feel like I'm jacked up in the morning sometimes. But we found a flower and we're halfway there. Oh, oh we're halfway there. Take my hand. We'll make it, I swear. Oh, oh living on a prayer. Bow, bow, bow. Bow, 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 bow. We have two Black Belt Samsons, who both have Makuhita's level 8. Jeez! It's a small world, isn't it? <laughs> oh my goodness. We're gonna go ahead and keep pecking you. Oh god. Ow. Shoot. Ow. I know, you guys are probably like, Kidder 5, how the crap can you hurt yourself? Well, let me tell you. I stubbed my toe like... On Wednesday, I think. I know it's Saturday. That was the first time I've actually stubbed my toe. My toe started... It felt like it started bleeding to death. And now I just, like, stubbed it on my chair. I know. I know. <coughs> oh, God. <coughs> I might have cut that out and might not have. Um, <clears throat> but my saliva probably just <coughs> went down the wrong tube, so he's going to send in a Meditite level 9, let me guess. I cannot talk today. I don't know why. I just cannot talk today. Um, he's going to send out a Meditite, though, as we're going to go ahead and try to peck it, but he is going to bide, which is... Great, because we got a critical hit. It's a crit. Jeez. No, I'm just kidding. Let's go ahead. I need to write that down as we have uh, defeated Black Belt Samson again because everybody's named Samson in this gym. Dang. We'll better look next time. To, to you? Or, or to me? I don't know, um, but anyways, let's go ahead, 
Jeez, I just dropped my pen on the mouse. Oh, wait, inside the recording. Uh, but we, we still need to find ourselves before we can, uh, wreck ourselves. Um, or should I say shrek ourselves, but that's inappropriate. Let's leave it how it is, because, yeah, we need one more flower, which I'm back to normal. Yay! I'm, I'm, I'm back to normal. Get wrecked. I don't know. Um, but let's go ahead and take a look at our Pokemon. Um, actually, I think we're fine. I might lead off with Julio, just so we don't sweep it with Mrs. Suit. Because I don't like sweeping gyms. Gyms are supposed to be hard, and if we sweep them, then that's not hard. And it's not fun. Uh, but we are stocked up enough on potions. Uh, can anyone learn strength? If anyone cannot learn strength, I'm going to be mad. Alright, Cutie Bone can. So, let's go ahead and talk to, um, <clears throat> oh yeah, I need to lead off with Julio. Uh, let's go ahead and switch to you up front. Let's go ahead and talk to you, Mr. Devin. Wait, no, how do I do this? There we go. That, it's good enough, right? I hope so. <clears throat> All right. Greetings, I am Devin. Bruh, I'm the gym leader of Superior Town, and I use flying types to my way to success. Bruh, you don't have a chance. As it is C rate versus Devin. So, Devin has an uh, interesting sprite, to say the least, here, uh, as he al also has three Pokemon along with us. And as he starts off with Machop level 10. So I'm gonna go ahead and just go for damage right away and we're gonna go for a water gun Does a decent amount as low kicks not doing anything. Let's be honest uh, So we're gonna go ahead and heal probably heal this turn, but there's no reason to Oh Oh my goodness, I'm sorry There's no reason not to keep water gunning as he's gonna keep using a potion which is fine by me um He's just using all of his potions right now, which means he doesn't use it on his ace, which, um, is coming out right here. Um, I'm just going to stay in to make it entertaining, because I'm pretty sure Mrs. Suit can take Riolu out, but, um, I'm just going to try to make it a little bit funner. Funner. Oh my goodness. More fun! If that, I don't know which one's a word, honestly, does anybody? But you're trying to counter me, which is not funny, because this is serious stuff. If you ke keep spamming counter, I'm literally going to be really mad. I'm literally going to be really mad. Re really, Kid Raid 5? You are? I didn't know that. I'm so stupid. But we do take Riolo out here with the water gun. And because I don't want a Julio sweep, we're just going to go ahead and switch out into Mrs. Hoot. So you can pack this thing. To all faint. Yeah, that makes absolutely no sense. But you know what? We're going to do it. He, It's time for him to turn around. But you know what? That's going to be stopped by him detecting. Well then, I love how everybody can do, uh, honestly, confuse me in, oh, I, I, I meant to say confusion, really? And then I said confuse me, and then it confused me, but Peck's not doing too much, so you can obviously tell here, as confusion may take down Mrs. Suit here, no? Alright, um... Oh, are you, are you kidding me? A oh, confusion. Don't take me out. Okay. And we snapped out. Oh, boy. Coming in clutch. We don't have quick attack. And I'm just going to let Mrs. Suit die. Because it's fun to let someone die. And I need Cutie Bone to take the experience. Honestly, because Cutie Bone will tank something. Now, I'll probably outspeed. Because Cutie Bone's is freaking jolly. Jolly F. I mean, honestly. Oh, God. Oh, no. That didn't do anything. Bone Club for the win, Cutie Bone coming through. Boy, Cutie Bone's coming through. Gym Leader Devin's down for the count. Bro, that was an excellent battle. Radical. 
Bruh, you're pretty good. I'm obligated to give you the discipline badge. Obtain the discipline badge. Oh, bruh, and you can have this TM too. And we got Brick Break? Are you kidding me? That's so good. Bruh, a technical machine? Or TM for short is a device that can teach your Pokemon a specific move. This TM will teach the move Brick Break. It's a fight type move that can break through many defenses. I hope you find it helpful. Well, and, and we just get teleported out of the gym right th then and there. It's interesting. We're honestly only 15 minutes into the episode. And I'm going to actually go ahead and teach Cutie Bone... No, I don't want to teach Cutie Bone Strength since we're actually using it. Because we can go ahead and get that dolly. Uh, so, you don't need to waste a spot on... I hope Riolu can... Um... Um, a learn strength, so we don't have to teach it, teach it to Cutie Bone. Um, so let's go ahead. Uh, let's see. Brick, I mean strength. God dang. Uh, you can learn strength, so I'm gonna go ahead and teach you strength. So nobody cares about endure. Honestly, foresight's better than endure. Endure is a poor man's protect. Right? Yeah. Alright, um, so let's go ahead and go in here. Oh, uh, wait. No, I don't care if we can't get repels. I honestly don't care. Let's go ahead, move along. We're running around at the speed of a human being. Ha! I gotcha! I was gonna, you thought I was gonna say running around at the speed of sound, didn't you? I said running around at the speed of, I don't know. I don't know anymore. Let's go ahead and move that. Actually, if you talk to this person. I heard that there was a rare item behind this boulder. Oh, if only I had the HM strength. Guess what? That someone who has the HM strength is moi. I don't know if he, like, comes to... Are you kidding me? Are you, like, trying to keep me from that Machop? Honestly, nobody cares. Nobody cares. But we did find the dolly. Um, so that's nice. And... Since we also actually do have strength with our Pokemon. Run. So nobody cares. Let's go ahead around here. Hopefully we don't run into too many Pokemons right here. Let's go ahead and go in there. And I believe if we go around here. Yeah, we can go ahead. Yes, let's <clears throat> push you around. Oh, there's just an IV stone here. I was gonna think that you could get to the door from here. Doesn't matter. We'll still get to the door pretty quickly. Uh, there we go. We're at a wonder cave, and we have actually gotten the dolly. So that's really nice. We don't have to be using Riolu anymore. Let's go ahead and uh, deposit a Pokemon uh, named Riolu into box one. Um, that's we're, now we're all good in the hood, and let's go ahead and check out what the Pokemarts got in stock. Do you have repels? You sell repels. Thank you. I'm gonna buy five of them. That literally like burned half my money. Are you kidding me? Um, let's go ahead and buy like five super potions for now. Spend the rate on uh, the rate, the rest on great balls because you never know when we're gonna run into something that I want to catch. So that's that. Because actually, I'm we're getting to either one or two Pokemon. I'm not sure if I'm gonna use. One of them on my final team, but I know I'm going to use one of them. One out of the two of them. So that's that. Let's go ahead and uh, click on this boulder as we can uh, use the dolly to push you all the way out of the way because nobody cares. I want to go. And it's only for a million bucks a peach. Uh, yes. Yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't care. 
I thought, I thought he said, well, you teach me how to use it. No, he said, do you want me to teach you how to use it? No, I don't want you to teach me how to use it. I already know how to use it. I already used the freaking dolly. All right. Come on. Stop. Nobody cares. Let's do this. And little did I know, I pressed the enter button too many times. And, uh, wait, is that, is that just me or is there tall grass there? That's, that's, that's really interesting. Let's go ahead and talk to you, though. Oh, you're a trainer. Oh, okay. Wait, did I actually heal? I think I did. If I didn't, I'm going to be so mad. Anyways, it looks like we have a pretty good matchup here uh, with Ponyta coming in. Uh, and we're going to go ahead and water gun you. Uh, super effective, which is pretty nice. Uh, tail whip does not do anything to us. And we're going to go ahead and take out the Ponyta as we are going to get to level 14. I just noticed that Ponyta was level 14. That is kind of creepy. But we want to learn Focus Energy. Oh yeah, we want to learn Focus Energy. This thing probably going to be in our final moveset since we do have Sniper uh, and Focus Energy enhances our rate of getting crits, which is always nice. Uh, Pokemon Breeder Sarah is down for the count. There we go. And you know what? I think I'm going to end the episode off right here. So we're going to go ahead and save the game. And we're going to save the game IRL. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you mock punch that like button. Let's see if we can get more likes than the last episode. I don't know how many likes the last episode got. But let's see how many we can get. And uh, other than that. Uh, there's no question of the day for this year, so I'm gonna get up out, you guys. This is Code Raid 5 signing out. Thanks for watching, everybody, and have yourselves a good day.